Hello and welcome everyone, I am C.S. Gilmore and this is Into the Gloom. We just arrived at Dr. Warren's house. Wherever that is. What the? Okay, dimensional machine. Traveling through different realms is now possible with my new machine. It took me about seven years to develop the technology for that. I built it using only materials scattered around the gloom. It uses a basic input system for coordinates and a degree that represents the depth of a stratum. This machine can only teleport you to an internal stratum of the current dimension, creating a link between a link back to my lab through using the relocation device. Having one with you is mandatory while traveling, otherwise it will be impossible to return. In the future, I'll develop a technology to travel to other realms in the nowhere. I have not discovered a definitive mechanism to, to, know, the, to know the coordinates of each stratum. So far, by merely guessing, I found two peculiar places, the Dark Tunnel and the Red Plain. The first one seems to be just an eternal fall into the void, surrounded by weird voices coming from an unknown source. The Red Plain is explained in other documents of mine. In any case, if you are reading this confidential document because I'm not around, this can only mean that I am traveling right now. You, mu you may just wait here till my return. The coordinates of the Dark Tunnel, the Red Plain. P.S. There are two indicators on the machine. The Pulse indicator, which tells if the traveler is still alive, and the Connection indicator, the small light at the top of the machine, which tells if the relocation device still has connection with the machine. If my pulse is active, but the light is off, that means I'm trapped. If you need my help for something, I'll need you to rescue me first. So grab a relocation device and travel to the red plane. I'll leave clues around the place in case you need to find me. Dr. Warren. So that means he's alive. There's no light on, though. Or, that's light, probably. So yeah, he's trapped. Sounds like on the red plane. Weird device. That's cool. So I'm in a. So how did game my a bad operation send me to another dimension? About the gloom. This realm is certainly fascinating. The people who end up in here seem to be linked with terrible accidents in real, in real world, giving them a non-definitive death state. I still don't understand why the gloom gate is the closest one once you go to nowhere. It may be different depending on the way you abandon your body in the real world. In any case, the gloom, as I call this place, is a second chance to rebirth once you are dead. Like traveling between planes is possible. In theory, you can live forever recycling bodies. However, it may take some time till I completely understand how the astral travel works. The life in the gloom is different than in the real world. People don't get older here, they just disintegrate over time, even when time seems to be a non-existent factor. This place seems to consume all creatures after long time exposure. The darkness seems to keep you alive longer. You start like a normal person, but after some time your energy turns darker and weaker, to the point you lose your mind and become a wandering ghost, which is a very weak energy form of the gloom. Nothing can be done at that point. You will already be condemned to vanish and disappear forever. So that flash that I just keep seeing a person of is like it's a person who's disappearing forever dr Warren. wonder who it is it's not working there's nothing of use in this oh another note the red plane i called that realm like that because it's red the light source is unknown normally it would be the sun but in that place everything is red even during the night and even in underground environments maybe the air itself is red it has some kind of an unusual chemical composition I'll have to study that in my next travel to there. The atmosphere there is very heavy and the time is not frozen like in here. Night seems to be very creepy and hostile. I don't know what threats await me there. I want. I went there just one time to satisfy my curiosity. I will go again soon with enough supplies and with my assistant Marcus as my companion. So there's two people here? Dr. Warren and Marcus. And how did they get to this place? Um, dimensional machine... I'm gonna try the dark tunnel first, just because that sounds like the place I'm not supposed to go. 3, 8, 11, 20. 3, 8... Um... I'm not understanding this. 
Probably gonna look stupid because I can't remember how many it was how many degrees was in what in a thing. Uh, let's try this. Nothing happened. Nope. One twenty. That was okay. Three sixty was a full turnaround. So one twenty is a. Th let's see. Where would that be on this dial? So 360 is a full turnaround. That's, so it should be about a third of this on this dial, but I'm not sure where that's supposed to be. Oh, there we go. And apparently it's the other, in the other direction.
water pump is is not working. Oh, uh, okay. It's fixed. It should work. Generator's already running. Water pump. go turn that valve which will do something this change this red color changes the feel of the game completely like I hope that device was waterproof finally left that sad and obscure hospital. 
His mother was overjoyed when the doctors gave her that the news that, about his return. Ethan was acting weirder than usual. He barely said a word, and with a different voice tone each time he had to answer anything. I get the feeling I just got possessed. He seemed unsure and confused, but the doctors told his mother it could be a temporal personality disorder due to, the, to brain surgery post-effects. It was a normal day. Ethan was dining. His mother was disconcerted about his new personality, but very happy at the same time because the nightmare was finally over, and she believed he was going to be the same Ethan as before in the coming days. Unfortunately for her, she would never know the truth that the old Ethan was never going to return. Ooh, that's an insane looking picture. Because he is no longer among us. <laughs> so yeah, I got ending achieved, vanished. A new ending has been unlocked. New extra notes has been unlocked. I'll go through the notes some other time, like just a, maybe an episode of their own. Into the gloom. <sighs> okay, so second ending found. That's cool. Um, yeah. So those catch me, I get possessed. One of them takes my place. That's cool. Awesome. Um, well, I need a break. I've been recording a lot of episodes. I definitely want to continue with this game. I want to find the other three endings. So, I'm going to end it here. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Hit like, hit subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!